told you in the last video, thinking about doing some renos in here, some redecorating. And here we are. We got it all, well, mostly cleared out in here, cleared out where I'm gonna paint anyways. Got the mattress all out, which it looks so weird in here without the mattress. What are we doing, just painting? For now. Like for today? No, for now. Well, I gotta seal up this right. counter. Which, come on, Chelsea, it's been months. Why is the counter not sealed? I mean, the top is sealed, but like, yeah, these cracks are not sealed. So like, crap goes in them. And like over here, I really love this piece of the counter, but like it needs sealed. And I don't know how we're gonna get what's in there out of there. Maybe you can work on that while I'm painting. Is it just one one person painting? We only got one paintbrush? I did actually get multiple paintbrushes. I didn't know you wanted to help. Put them down. Make it a lot quicker. This is true. So we're painting, filling. Fixing this over here. Cause this was a great idea in theory, but it looks like absolute garbage. Um, so I'm not really sure what exactly I'm gonna do with that yet, but I'm gonna take this all down. And the reason we did this is cause it's cold. It's really cold. This is just a, pssst. and that, as we drive, it just goes. And I'm up front having a mental breakdown. All right, we're gonna take all this off, ow. Maybe I should take the tax out of it first. That would help. Oh my god, the sound of it is just... <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna take it off and we're gonna re-stick this back on with this stuff. And hopefully that holds it still and stops the madness. The squeaking. Okay. Do you know how to paint? I've seen the Karate Kid many times. Stop showing off. Do you know how to paint? Yes! What, what have you painted? All the places we lived in and stuff. Did you paint any of that? That's really thick. You want to thin it out more. Currently what I'm seeing is that it's still too thick. <laughs> that lasted all of a minute. Figured I'd give you a peek at my exciting job taking stuff out of these little cracks. Exhilarating. I'm over this. <laughs> Good thing we, there's two more coats to be done, apparently. Yeah, but tomorrow. Bright and early tomorrow. Yeah. And we are still determining what's going to be done here. All right, everyone. Well, that's the first coats anyway, and then pick it back up tomorrow. It's going to look good, though. I'm excited. Yeah, I like it a lot better. Why didn't we do this in the first place? Right? That's what I was just <laughs> The brown, it looked really nice, but the walls were just too dark. It's just too, right. it's just too dark for a small space. Agreed. You live and you learn. You live and you learn and you love and you laugh. You live and love and love and love and love. We'll see you tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Oh my God, there's a resin. Good morning, buddy. It's not looking good. Two coats? If we're lucky. If we're lucky, oh wow. It doesn't look like it's doing anything. Yeah, it kind of looks the same. All right, all right. We're headed to the dollar store again to get a roller. And then I'm gonna sand off the walls and try again because it looks horrible right now. And I think I should have probably sanded the wood first because it was stained. So basically, are we starting from... I don't know. Well, not from... I won't know until I sand it. But it looks like it's just gonna all come right off. A little bit of a setback. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Not a big deal since the guy who didn't paint four layers yesterday. Maybe if I had, we would be in different... <laughs> you don't know how to paint. <laughs> and you don't know how to listen to instructions, so... I was... That's not how you paint. You 
had it so thick on the wall. So yeah, fun, fun, fun today, 10 out of 10. Great day to get some work done. Ah! Gotta go. So, now we're, <laughs> we're back here after getting it sanded down. Are well, you starting on this side? Yeah. How's the roller working? A lot better. And I use this. Are you priming or painting? Priming. I'm using this primer instead of that primer. That primer's really thick. I think maybe it's old, because uh. there's only a little bit left in the bottom. I think we're good now. <laughs> this, you have to wait four hours. So, so I'm hoping I can prime twice and then paint and it'll be done. It'll be done? Yeah. Hopefully? Yeah. Listen to that. Oh my God. Yeah, the winds are a blowing out here. The storm is a brewing. But anyway, that's the update. I gotta go in and edit. I guess we'll show you more progress later. Yeah. Okay, so I've got that coat of primer on and I'm feeling a lot more confident with how this looks right now. It actually looks like the walls are gonna be white. Before it was just the dark just kept coming through. Not sure if I already said this, I think the primer we were trying to use was old and it was just not working. It wasn't really smoothing out like when I was like, Bradford, that's way too thick. I don't think it was his fault. I think it was the primer. And that's why when I was like trying to smooth it out, it was like leaving dark marks everywhere I put my brush, if that makes sense. Also, that was just a stupid decision on my behalf to get a brush. I know that rollers work better on walls, but I was just thinking where it's paneling that a brush might do better, but this mini roller worked excellent. I don't know if, yeah, you can see it behind me. It looks, it's looking white now. It's not yet. There's still like dark spots where I sanded coming through. But I think with another coat of primer and then a coat of paint, we should finally be good on that. So I'm going to do this. Still not sure what we're putting on top. I just know we need something on top of it because that is ugly. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna take it down and I'm gonna stick it back in there so we don't hear all that squeaking all the time. Oh, also I made a mood board for how I want this to look. So Bradford, put my mood board clip in here, please. And I am currently watching YouTube while I do this, and I'm watching the Sorry Girls. They're a duo from Toronto, Canada, and they do different renovations and stuff. They're super cool. Go check them out. I'll uh, link their channel below. I get a lot of inspo from them. They do a lot of thrifting too, which I love. So yeah, go follow another Canadian channel. And I'm gonna get back to work in here. I think I'm gonna be in here most of the day. So yeah. All right, oh my God, I need to shower or something. I used construction adhesive and it works with foam and metal. So I used it on these and for these three pieces, it's looking really good, but this piece is just not staying in. So I've got a bunch of duct tape on it. I'm gonna go around and try and just sand off where the um, cork is still stuck. I really don't know what to do with this wallpaper maybe like I really am just lost wood would probably be my best bet but I truly like I don't even know where to start with that maybe I'll do burlap I don't know stay tuned okay guys it is like two days later the painting is finally done I am obsessed with how this looks like even just behind me that's so exciting it's so much brighter in here and it makes it like so much bigger looking the dark really closed us in a lot I feel like we just went to Ikea Winners, a bunch of different places today to get the finishing touches. So I'm now going to do all that, but first, the most satisfying part of painting. Oh, really? That was, that sucks. Try that again. I'm not gonna lie, I fully did this so that it looks better on camera, but after doing it, I, I love it now. We did not end up changing this. Um, 
I put some construction adhesive down there, and that's what the duct tape is holding down, and hopefully kind of fixed it up. If not, we're just gonna get another sheet from the dollar store. I just couldn't find anything that I liked. Like, the only stuff that I actually liked was real tile, and I just don't feel adventurous enough to uh, go in with real tile. Not yet. Maybe someday. All right, finish off that, and then we need to make the bed with our new duvet cover, our new throw pillows. Gonna do up our board new. We get some new decorations for the counter and some other things to bring some life into here. I'm excited. Okay, here's a little decorating life hack. I didn't wanna buy a new duvet because we already have a comforter, but the comforter is kind of getting messed up. It's a little bit pilled, has a couple burn holes in it from the firework incident, but it's good and I, I like it. It's like the right amount of heaviness for me, which probably sounds weird to some people, but I'm sure other people get it. Duvets are just really heavy. They make me feel like suffocated and the ones that are too light don't really do much for warmth. So our old black comforter is now in this duvet cover. Duvet cover was $29 with pillowcases. Duvet covers are really easy to resell on Marketplace or at yard sales, so you can switch them out quite often without having any waste. And I'll shush and make the bed. Ooh, this looks so good with the white. Okay, now which end is what in on here? Let's put this over there. Wait a minute. I may have put the blanket in wrong. The buttons go on the side, right? Now I'm really unsure. Yeah, it's definitely supposed to go the other way. The blanket's in there though, and it doesn't seem like it's wrong. I'm just turn around. I don't know. See, this looks like a duvet. So you get that, you get that luxurious look without the luxurious price tag. Sick. Oh yeah, this looks nice. God, I hope we don't stain it. <laughs> oh my God, this is heavenly. Here's some, some things I'm unsure of. Okay, so I love this color. Definitely keeping that. Do I put it on here? Or does the bed actually look good with just those and I put it down here? Also, I got this white one, and if you've heard before, we use these for like sweaters and stuff. You can kind of see them. Okay, wait, wait, maybe we do the one white one there, and we do the two greens down here. Yeah, then maybe add like a Christmas one when we're decorating. Also, I'm very upset I didn't paint these white, honestly. I was going to and then I didn't and now I really don't like how it looks so I will probably end up doing that. We got this beautiful throw at Value Village. Five dollars. I love it. Now do I put this here or on the bed? Definitely on the bed. You guys are seeing my whole thought process here. Everyone always puts throws on the bed really cute and like diagonally and I haven't quite been able figure out how that's done. Oh, is it really this easy? I just fold it on the diagonal and then... Yeah, I think I do like those there. And I mean, now we have a lot less room for clothes storage, but I like it a lot better. Seven throw pillows in here was just way too much. Do you, this doesn't even look like the same van. Oh my God, I love it. Okay, we got a few more final touches. Then I'm gonna bring Bradford out to show him. We finally have a plant back. I am gonna put some plumber's putty, that's what it's called. I think I'm gonna put some of that in here just so it doesn't shake around when we're driving. It looks like this. And it works really good for sticking stuff to the counter so it doesn't slide around and it's not like you know, it's not like Velcro where you're gonna have something sticky left over. You can just wipe it off, so it's really nice. I'm gonna put it on the back so you can't see it. And now you shouldn't really be able to see it. I'm gonna hold it in. Oh yeah, there we go. There's also only one of these pots, so I think it was speaking to me. Like, Chelsea, don't go crazy. You can't fit two plants in here. Regardless, I'm happy to have one back.
pretty. I'm gonna go get Bradford and show him. You're good, keep going. You ready? Yeah. Where am I? Look. I can open? Yeah. Damn! It's completely different. Right? It's That's so what much, I said. It's like a totally different band. It's so much brighter and like, oh, it's way nicer though, honestly. Mm -hmm. I think it's way better. Mm hmm. Oh, look, you even got the little book out. Yeah. Fancy. Oh, the crystals look nice on that, too. They're not all bunched up. On the yeah. Thing. They're my favorite ones, too. Yeah. Like, I don't like the... I yeah. Don't, I don't like these ones. This was a good idea. And I think this is all we need for thread pillows. Oh, yeah, you got the green ones. To, oh, I didn't even notice that. Yeah, no, that looks good. Yeah, the plan was green, white, green over here. But I just, I like it just like that. I don't think we yeah, need throw pillows no. on the bed. The one throw pillow, maybe if we see like ones with like little cute sayings or something, we can pick those up, but. Yeah, this is nice. This is a nice vibe. Did you notice the plant? Oh, over there, no, I didn't. I, I, so I think Did you the, try it over I there? was gonna say, I think the one pot was for a reason. Uh, okay. We only got enough room for one plant. Uh, okay. Yeah, no, that's a nice touch too. Mm hmm yeah. I find the white brings these out so much. It brings everything out, yeah. honestly. Do you think we're going to be able to keep that comforter? Do you make over that? I don't know, as long as we make sure the, we make sure the dogs are cleaned off before we that, and when we let eat, them on it. When we eat, we'll have to lay something under <laughs> us. Yeah, that too, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, it'll be all right. All right, well, that's it for our new van. I think it costs, I didn't really add everything, but I think like maybe a little over $100. I have stuff I have to return, so I would say about $100. I got some of this stuff, like this blanket and this crystal grid and these um, plant holders. I got all those at Value Village, secondhand. We love secondhand. And uh, yeah, I used some stuff I already had, obviously. Really all we bought was the duvet cover, bought new duvet cover, and these pillow things, Pillows. I think. Oh, and this tray. The tray, yes. I looked everywhere for this tray. <laughs> I was looking for a white circle one, but this one I think fits the vibe better anyways. I'm excited. Let us know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you like this one better, or did you like it better before? We like it though, so. That's what matters, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Next, next week. Christmas, Christmas fire. We, <laughs> we Christmas fire. Yeah, next week we're decorating for Christmas. It'll look really good with the white. Like I felt like before we had like so much going on, mm -hmm. and now we just went the complete opposite direction. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's it. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. We're almost to four hundred subscribers. Maybe we'll get 500 subscribers for Christmas. That would be sick. <laughs> that would be I'd sick. I'd like that. It'd be yeah. a nice gift. Yeah. All of December, but. we're going to try and do Christmas videos, right? Try. Yeah. 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 Have, like, Christmas themes. All right. We're going to go enjoy our new van. Toodles. Toots. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't ask me what I'm doing. We lasted all of maybe two hours with the new duvet cover before somebody dropped something on it. <laughs> I can't even explain what happened. It was like... It's natural peanut butter, which has oil at the top, and he's walking around carrying it, dripping it all over the place. He didn't even notice it was on the bed. He's like, oh, why is this dripping everywhere? It was the and I look over and I just see a splotch right there. The blanket that is supposed to be covering the bed while he eats was just over ever so slightly. 
Couldn't drop it on the blanket. No, had to drop it on our new freaking duvet cover. The top was on, so I don't know. No, the top was not on, and it still isn't. And I see it running all down the side. Show the freaking peanut butter. Turn it around so I can see the... Yeah, get it all on your finger. <laughs> oh, uh, okay, it's right there. That's just, I don't understand. I don't know, it doesn't make sense. Karate. Robert, can you help? <laughs> uh, so they're super, they're, uh, they're. So yeah, lots of fun today, fun fun. Jesus. <laughs> Speed bump, Robert. A few more final touches and then I'm gonna, see what they look like. They're not working. 